Welcome to Investors Insights. Our topic today is earnings up, growth accelerating. The reason we chose that topic is our theme throughout this year so far has been that we've been in a recession of confidence and that that confidence has come back. And hopefully, as, as you will see today, while you're hearing a lot of news media out there talking about the negatives going on, behind the scenes, there's a lot of positives. On that note, Bobby, uh, in our meeting this morning, you brought up uh, about earnings. Talk about that and what we're seeing. Yeah, we've been talking about since the beginning of the year that earnings will be key. And so far, we're really liking what we're seeing. Earnings so far, the first quarter, are tracking for a 14.7% or 14.7% increase year over year. And so since last year, that's a nice increase. Extremely yeah, important, nice. beating expectations. Even more important, corporate guidance for the rest of this year is very strong. And so we talk about every week, there's so much uncertainty around D.C., geopolitical risk. As long as we continue to have great earnings, we're on track for some good things. Well, and, and let me say this, uh, earnings reflect stock prices. Mm -hmm. Is that correct? Everybody exactly. agree with Absolutely. me on that? Last time I checked yeah. that formula, that's how it works. <laughs> Still that, works. That was one of our concerns in 2016. Corporate earnings were not going up. Extremely so, important. So yeah. Especially this tight trading range we've had the past couple of weeks. Right. It's holding it up. With all the risk we see elsewhere, earnings are really holding it up mm -hmm. and give us a chance to go up. Yeah, yeah. There are no guarantees there, but it's yeah. good to have that kind of numbers coming in. So now, Ashley, you tied into that because as we got into this big debate and discussion, you said, uh, Bobby, I will agree with you on that because of these reasons. Talk about your points. Absolutely. Well, on the GDP side, you know, to tie this Gross off, domestic product. Gross domestic product. You know, we didn't grow that much in the first quarter. We covered that on the vlog a couple of weeks ago. That's correct. But now, looking at it, it looks like GDP is accelerating into the second quarter. We'll know for sure at the end of June, of right. course but it could be on track to be the best quarter we've had since 2014. Okay, um, all right, that's the great. The Federal Reserve Bank of Atlanta is forecasting about a 3.6% okay. pop. Excellent. Okay, and so let me get this right. Earnings are up. Yes. You're seeing the economy growing. Therefore, that gives earnings and more reason to go up as, as consumers are out Our there. Spending. And that's spending, that's correct. correct. Yeah. Okay, yeah, but on, on that note, uh, you also brought up, though, the consumer still hasn't fully stepped forward. Oh, We've absolutely. got major confidence going on. Correct. But in terms of the consumer, talk about the three points you made. I thought that our viewers need to hear that. Yeah, when you look at consumer spending, it's a three-part, like three-leg of a stool. It's wealth, how the consumer is feeling about their wealth. It's their income, how much they're being paid, and how much they're able to borrow. Right. And part of the reason that the first quarter was down a little bit is that borrowing is way off. That was the component that was down. Sure. The how you felt about your wealth was up. Right. How your income was, was up. So the key things that would drive a good economy, those two factors were off. It was just the borrowing that was down. Okay. So once that improves a little bit, that will reaccelerate. Sure. And especially, I think you pointed out on auto loans, is that correct? That's correct. The only yeah. place that, that borrowing is up is on auto loans, but everything else, borrowing was way down. Okay. So, right. and, and is now returning, which is great. Okay. All right. So, on that note, what we want to do here at Five Plan Partners is bring you information that rises above the news media buzz that's out there. We're not trying to just regurgitate and feed you the same news. And hopefully, you're getting valuable information. And also, we throughout the week, we will continue to deliver that through Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, and other social media media, as well as this vlog. So keep in touch. We also, one-on-one, -on -one, in person, we will continue to be in touch with you. And if this is of value to you, please forward it to those around you who might find benefit in it as well. On that note, have a great week, and we thank you for watching.